going on people? It's AV Talks here and today's an exciting day. Why? Because I've been waiting for the longest time for this little piece of mod for my R8 car to come and it's finally here. So we're going to install it, you guys can watch how I do it um, and let's get to it. Also I don't know what to do with this, basically I'm upcycling a bed rather than throwing it away and what I've done is, if I get this other camera actually, hold on. Yeah, so what I've done is I've upcycled the bed and turned it into a planter. Um, doesn't look that much yet because it's not finished. I just need to sand it down. I need to add these three posts here um, to act like a trellis. And then I need to get a staple gun to staple this sort of plastic membrane for the soil. Um, what I quite like actually, I was trying to reinforce the bottom. And I was going to saw off the bottom of this, but it turns out that if I add a barrier to it, which I did over here, it acts like a second shelf for like plant pots and stuff. So yeah, just gonna saw this off, sand it down, paint it with fence paint or shed paint so it don't rot. This is what I was trying to source. The R8 steering wheel badge. Um, it was quite hard to source actually because it was the old logo. Um, but I finally found a company that um, was selling it. Let's get to it. So we've got to disconnect the battery. Let me see. Yeah, just along there. I think. Remove that. And that must be the negative. This is the steering wheel in all its glory. It's a nice steering wheel, but it's just missing the R8 logo just here. So I'm gonna take this out and install the logo, but to take it out, you've got to take out the airbag and remove the silver trim. Well, let's go. What I'm gonna do is, I'm gonna turn that off. I'm gonna turn on the car, and we're gonna twist it round this way just like that and take off this screw cap yeah so I don't know if you can see it but where is it it's a bit gone yeah let me see if I can focus on that just want to unscrew that and you've got to turn the steering wheel the other side and unscrew that as well alright that's done now, I've got to turn the car the other way. Alright, that's out now. So, just got to remove the steering wheel. Carefully. Right, so as you can see, that looks much better. Um, I chose to go with the original R8 logo just so it fits the year of the car. And I don't know about you guys, but I'm a bit OCD with things matching. So R8 there and obviously the R8 here. Whereas if I updated it with a newer logo, uh, when I'm driving, it'll probably bug me. But yeah, that's it. Anyways, hope you guys enjoyed the video. If you liked it, please press the like button, comment and subscribe. And I guess I'll see you at the next one.